So you have additional time, you can go through the some uh, specific areas and specialize into that. For additional material, there are close to 200 documentation we published into our blog. You can download them. These are various series like how to series. Some of the documents I publish for global access. However, 60% of documents are for our internal students and our clients. So we have a how to series in which we simulate various OBI problems and how to solve them. Every day we have a policy. Any one of my clients, any one of my consultants find some difficult issues. And the moment he overcome that, we, we document that. So we publish a how to series. We also have a beginner's guide series in various situations, how do you deal with. So these are two very popular uh, learning material we have. Apart from that, you will be getting installation document, installation video, document, everything. Uh, that is a part of learning. We will also give you a practice application, all the case studies, which, which would be complete end to end implementation. So case studies, something like this, right from the requirement, step by step, we will you know, relatively great hard work. Uh, the requirement, what are the various dimensions associated with this, how the logical data model is designed, physical data model, I'm sorry, logical data model, the various aspects of mapping, what are the variables are used, step by step process, the way we solve the business problem, we document them into the certain order. And all the mapping, you know, you see, this is one of the most detailed documentation you can have it in a project. This has 600 plus mapping. So each important element, what is the business meaning of it, what is the calculation associated of it, and eventually what is the hierarchy, how it is to be present to the user, data modeling, presentation, everything which we do in day to day life, we present it, we document this. And eventually we display the reports to the user. So, for example, for financial reports, what is the client requirement? We design a wireframe. A wireframe is like a template which client, uh, you know, requested and we designed to them, for them, in terms of Excel sheet before actually building the report. So, we prepare a template and underline data model and showcase to them in order to get their consent that the, uh, the solution we are building it meets their requirement or not. As a part of requirement analysis, we prepare these templates. For example, financial financial ratio analysis, these are the templates, balance sheet, cash flows, revenue from different operations, top end analysis, company performance trend. So how the report should look like to the user. We present to the user in terms of wireframe. For a CEO, for an organization CEO, he would like to see complete organization strength in one go. It's called dashboard, right? The dashboard of your car, where you have various uh, equipments, all the buttons are clubbed together into a common dashboard so that you don't have to, you know, go to a different places to operate your car. Similarly, in dashboard, we club various important aspects of a business into one common page. This is at the end of the day business manager or CEO would like to see. The various channel of revenues, various channel of uh, expenditure. So how these business requirements are captured and prepare interactive dashboard. It sit on top of your answer. So this is what we are going to talk about uh, in beginners in case studies in as a part of additional learning. For installation and support, if we have a policy for every every job we do, a policy based company. So many people have question that which version we are going to learn. We are going to learn OBI 10G and 11G both. Uh, why did we keep both the version together? You know, 11G is the next version of 10G. Therefore. There are some additional components are added, but it does not mean 
the basic components are discarded. We also want to showcase to the user the migration from 10G to 11G. There are large number of assignments and requirements are there in the market for migration work. And we want our training, the training should be productive for you and therefore we get more business. So we we have a one session on migration of all the reports and data model from 10G to 11G. In order to do this, we want you to ensure, we want to ensure that you know 10G and 11G both the version. So the RPD data modeling will be doing in 10G. At the same time, I also demonstrate if any new components has arrived in 11G. I'll showcase to you. So 10G would be used for RPD building plus 11G new components. There are new components arrived like we have a parent-child relationship hierarchy in 11G. It was not there in 10G. So we'll do this. The answer and dashboard would be completely on 11G because this is more user interactive. OB, RPD is back-end work. Right? Answer and dashboard is more user interactive. So we try to do everything in OBI. Most recent release 11.1.1.5 This is what we are going to do for 11G answer and dashboard including BI publisher as well. Installation support will give you so this is working version installation support uh, will give you installation video we give you installation document very detailed and very detailed document with lot of screenshots and all the prerequisite even from where to download how to unzip this also we cover uh, we want to ensure that people using our documentation even if they are new to computers they should be able to do this job so in installation documentation of all the version 10G, 11G, any version, new version come, we are the first few people to document the stuff. Will be shared. If you still have any issue in installation, there would be support team which works in India time would assist you on mutual availability basis. But you need to make sure. Uh, your system satisfy all the prerequisite. These days there are pre-built image from Oracle. You can even download that from Oracle which are like VMware version. Just download the pre-built ready-made installer from Oracle site and just point your VMware to that. It's pretty big 25 GB space of OBI 11G with high PAN. There's a pre-built image available in Oracle site. You can download that and point to your um, ready-made image. Therefore, you can save your time in installation. Up to you. You want to exposure, you want to have some hands-on on how things are installed. You can configure 11G in your local system or you can use the ready-made version depends upon your choice okay we also have a missing class policy a missing class we provide live classes to the people however we understand as a part of your day-to-day -day work there's a possibility you stuck up in some project you need to have unscheduled traveling so we provide a recorded session of missing class provided that you communicate to us few missing classes subjected to beforehand communication.